Hello. Hello. Welcome to the video. Please watch the video completely. In this video, I will discuss the causes, symptoms, diagnosis, treatment and prevention of chikungunya. What is chikungunya? Chikungunya is a viral disease transmitted to humans by infected mosquitoes. It is caused by the chikungunya virus and is characterized by sudden fever and joint pain that can be severe and debilitating. The name chikungunya derives from a word in the Kimikan language that translates to that which bends up, referring to the contorted appearance of sufferers with joint pain. The disease was first described during an outbreak in southern Tanzania in 1952. Chikungunya had been detected in countries in Africa, Asia, Europe, and the Indian and Pacific Ocean regions. Signs and Symptoms of Chikungunya The first sign of Chikungunya will typically be a fever, followed by a rash. After the bite of an infected mosquito, onset of illness usually occurs 4 to 8 days later, but the range can be 2 to 12 days. Symptoms include Sudden onset of high fever, typically above 102 degrees Fahrenheit Joint pains Headache Myalgia Arthritis Conjunctivitis Nausea Vomiting Maculopapula Rash Characterized by a flat red area on the skin covered with elevated bumps While the majority of people infected with the virus will have symptoms 3 to 28 percent of people infected with chikungunya will remain asymptomatic according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC US Causes and Risk Factors of Chikungunya Chikungunya is a viral disease transmitted to humans by infected mosquitoes It is caused by the chikungunya virus Chick An infected person cannot directly transmit the virus to another person the disease is spread when a mosquito feeds on a person with the virus circulating in their blood. The mosquito can pick up the virus and spread it to another person through its bite. Chikungunya virus is most often spread to people by Aedes aegypti and Aedes, all Bopictus mosquitoes. These are the same mosquitoes that transmit dengue virus. Chick epidemics in Africa and Asia have been primarily associated with the urban mosquito Aedes aegypti. Eds orbopictus has been introduced as a second major spreader of chick. Eds orbopictus is more widely distributed and has the ability to survive in temperate climates. This is unlike Eds aegypti, which live predominantly in tropical and subtropical areas. Proximity of mosquito breeding sites to human habitation is a significant risk factor for chikungunya. How is chikungunya diagnosed? A series of blood tests to detect the presence of chikungunya virus or antibodies. Several methods can be used for diagnosis of chikungunya virus infection. Serological tests, such as enzyme-linked immunosorbent, assays, ELISA, may confirm the presence of M and anti chikungunya antibodies. Chikungunya virus antibodies normally develop toward the end of the first week of illness. IM antibody levels are highest 3 to 5 weeks after the onset of illness and persist for about 2 months. The virus may be directly detected in the blood during the first few days of infection as well. Samples collected during the first week of illness are tested by both serological and virological methods. Blood tests can also look for similar viruses like dengue and Zika, which have similar symptoms. Test results are normally available 4 to 14 days after a specimen is received by the lab. Treatment and medication options for chikungunya. There is no specific antiviral drug for chikungunya, so, treatment involves relieving the symptoms. Treatment includes antipyrotics to reduce fever, analgesics for pain relief and to reduce fever, drinking plenty of fluids, rest, an important precaution. Given the similarity of symptoms between chikungunya and dengue, in areas where both viruses circulate, suspected chikungunya patients should avoid using aspirin or non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs NSAIDs, until a dengue diagnosis is ruled out. This is because these medicines can increase the risk of bleeding with dengue. Once a diagnosis is established, patients with persistent joint pain can use non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs and corticosteroids, including topical preparations. Physical therapy may help lessen the symptoms. Prevention of chikungunya. There is no vaccine or 
preventive drug for chikungunya, so the best way to avoid infection is to prevent mosquito bites. Apply mosquito repellent to exposed skin. Drape mosquito netting over beds. Put screens on windows and doors. Treat clothing, mosquito nets, tents, sleeping bags and other fabrics with an insect repellent called permethrin. Wear long pants and long sleeves to cover your skin. Thanks for watching.